So let's take a look. Once you've done all the hardware and you've created your outlet and your circuit somehow, then you have to connect it to your uh, Reef Pi in terms of getting the software. So connect it to your GPIO pin on your Raspberry Pi that's carrying your Reef Pi software. First thing we need to do to configure the relays is we go over to the equipment tab or to the configuration tab and make sure that our equipment box is, is enabled. Uh, then, once our equipment box is enabled, we go over to connectors and we have to add an outlet connection for each one of the relays. So if you see in my software here, I've got uh, one through eight called MEC, so those are mechanical relays one through eight, and then I've got SS solid state one through four. Uh, so it's a simple, all you gotta do is give it a name of whatever you want and the pin that's associated with that relay. And once that's done, always remember to update and, and save your, your, your settings there. Then you can come over here to your equipment tab and you can add the equipment to your system so you can control it. Uh, so once your outlets and your inlets are in there in the configuration, then you can do things with it in the Reef Pi, like turn it off. Or on. So right now I'm hearing clicks in the other room because that mechanical relay just went off and on. Uh, and that's very simple. It's just a matter of, again, adding a new piece of equipment, giving it a name, and choosing the outlet that you assigned uh, over in your configuration. And then, once you've got your equipment in your system, then you can do things with it. Then you can assign that equipment to, say, an auto top-off. So, uh, a control pump is, is actually a piece of equipment on your outlet there, or say uh, with your temperature, uh, control heater, that would be one of your, one of your pieces there, uh, or say maybe a timer. Uh, you want to add a timer, and then which piece of equipment is this timer going to control? So you can add all sorts of ways to manipulate and control that equipment in your Reef Pi, and then you can see it on your dashboard doing its thing. Uh, also, you can see this handy dandy graph that just monitors just your equipment state. Is your equipment on, off? And you'll, you'll know why by its name and how it's controlled uh, in your own settings, your own personal settings that you want to create for your, your aquarium. That's about it. The instructions are in the description. Uh, again, I suggest taking a look at other people's videos on how they created these relay controlled outlets and uh, all done. All right, later.